Hey, uh, this is my first time doing an ASMR video. So, um, I guess we'll see how it goes. Um, I don't really have a lot planned out for what I want to do. I was just going to kind of, you know, talk a little bit, whispering and, um, also soft speaking. And I, um, I have a couple things that I've seen in other videos that I wanted to try out and um, see how well they worked out for me. Um, I'm largely going to focus on the kinds of things that uh, I guess the uh, ASMR triggers that uh, particularly affect me. So um, first of all, this video is probably not going to be very long in that case because I usually don't. Um, it's hard for me to keep my attention on something for like a long time, for like 45 minutes or 50 minutes, so this is going to be a lot shorter than that, and um, you know, I might be a little faster paced, I just, you know, if I'm going to do these, I'm just going to have to try it out and um, slowly kind of, I guess, uh, let it sink in for me and let me see what, you know, what works best. So, um, I guess I can kind of, uh, start to whisper, I guess, a little bit, you know, try that out, let me focus this a little off, whatever. Um, oh yeah, I also have some food, well, I have some strawberry frosted mini wheats, that's the only food I have in my apartment right now, and, um, I have some water and some soda. Unfortunately, the soda's flat, so I'm not sure that that's gonna um, be very good for the ASMR, but, you know, we'll see. We'll see how it all goes. So, um, you know, I might just get close like this because uh, I recently saw a video on the internet that um, for the ASMR day recently, up videos like that and I found that to be um, very very uh, um, trigger worthy I guess you could say if you want to use that whole nomenclature that's kind of developed um, yeah I'm not really sure what to make of the whole ASMR thing it's kind of weird that um you know it's never really been I guess discovered or uh, documented like this until now. I guess um, I've tried to get a couple of my friends to uh, watch these videos and um, you know it just hasn't worked for them so I guess it's just one of those phenomena that you know only has an effect on you know a certain group of people or you know a certain amount of people so you know I'm glad that I'm one of those people and I'm hoping to be one of those people who can uh, you know provide content for other people who um, might be able to appreciate it, especially in a world where apparently, uh, you know, a lot of people are unable to do so. So, uh, like I said, it'll just be pretty short. I might try out a couple things. I don't really have any non-verbal triggers to try out other than water and soda and food. So, I might get a little, I don't know if it'll be gross if I get closer and, uh, start to chew food. So once again, I'm sorry. I'm kind of out of focus here when I'm closer up. I'm just going to try everything out. So I'll just be farther back here for a while. Um, yeah, I'll do a little whispering and I'll do a little soft speaking. I hope that, um, you know, shuttling between them a lot isn't going to be, you know, kind of distracting or, you know, unsettling rather than being relaxing. So, I'll see. So I have some of these, um, they're just strawberry frosted mini wheats. Actually, they're, um, really, they're the Kroger knockoff, um, variety of frosted mini wheats. So, you know, they're, they're not quite as good, in my opinion, but, um, you know, in America these days, the brand name really kind of 
effect on your on your mind side about that kind of stuff, how genuine it really is, you know, if the flavor's actually different. Who really knows? You know? So So honestly, my pacing here is just going to kind of be, you know, however I, however I kind of feel like going from here. So how, you know, if I'm, you know, talking too fast or uh, doing anything too fast, you know, just let me know. I can switch things up, but, um, yeah, so honestly... I don't normally drink cereal with milk just because, um, I don't know, we ever had milk in my household when I was younger, so, you know, maybe skim milk, um, but mostly things like soy milk and all, almond milk and that kind of thing, and I didn't really like that either, so I kind of got used to eating cereal just by itself like that, so, you know. Honestly, it kind of sucks, but whatever. I do it almost every day for breakfast. Yeah, I find the whole food eating thing for ASMR kind of interesting because, you know, really that kind of thing would normally disgust me and, um, you know, kind of make me sick to that close to someone eating and, um, you know, in certain moods that it is, but I have found that, you know, it can be very relaxing, um, you know, just the sound of food, even, you know, in someone's palate. Sorry about that, I'm not sure what's going on out there. I think they're doing construction on this apartment complex, so, you know, hopefully it won't be too distracting. Yeah, back to what I was saying, um, just, you know, I find that, you know, it is relaxing, the food sounds and all that, um, you know, for me personally, um, but yeah. Um, I'm not really sure what kinds of things I want to talk about when I, um, you know, delve into these things, so, yeah, I'll just kind of ramble. Honestly, I found a lot of times that kind of just pointless, senseless rambling, I mean, from other content producers has been the best for me, you know, something I don't have to, something that doesn't distract me, doesn't make me think, you know, a lot, and get my, um, you know, get stress levels up and get all that going, so, you know, I don't mind that kind of thing, but I can kind of, I can zero in on topics in the future if, um, if all this works out, so, let's get to the soda, I guess. I don't know how well you can hear the fizz sounds, um, it's mostly flat, like, found that doing that is actually kind of a um, kind of a 
relaxing sound for me, actually. The whole, um, the whole kind of, um, well, what I was doing with this soda there, I'll do it again. should be probably be kind of fun I guess you know I've done stuff like that before so um, you know I'd be open to that sort of thing um, you know ju just about anything honestly um, I know a lot of people use ASMR to go to sleep and I'm not sure you know if, if you should just blend out you know with just Soft, softer and softer speaking and whispering until, you know, the person falls asleep. I don't really know what to do here, so. Um, since I'm just about out of ideas here. ASMR really easily. Some people can. And I've heard some people can only get it from other places, but I actually feel a little like I'm getting it to myself right now, honestly. I've run out of ideas essentially so um, you know I'll see what kind of response this video gets and contingent upon that I'll uh, perhaps make some more content <laughs> 